All right, y'all, so I'm currently headed to the gas station real quick. About to grab a beverage real quick. After I do that, y'all, I'm hearing that Gordon Ramsay got a new restaurant out here, bruh. That fish and chips joint, he just put it in Washington, D.C. I'm about to dry there real quick. We gonna try them fish and chips, y'all. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a water because these kidney stones been killing me again. Them stones just were not let up, y'all, and it's crazy to me, bruh. Like, I thought that I, I defeated the stones. I urinated them out. And they was up in the toilet, bruh, but they back up in their kidneys, fool. And I just don't know what to do. Like, fuck it. Eat my ass. Fuck Biden. Democrats can suck my- What? Y'all, I feel like politics is one of the biggest scams ever, you feel me? I feel like at the end of the day, it's just put there to divide and conquer the people. Because they already know that if the people ain't working together, then they can continue to manipulate and control the people. You know what I'm saying? Like, this dude's out here making posters saying fuck Democrats and fuck all this other shit. And it's just like, come on, bro. Like, what is that shit really doing? You know what I'm saying? Like, the poster's not really doing anything. Alright y'all, so I'm down here at the wharf, not gonna lie to y'all, y'all gonna have to pay for parking if y'all decide to come out here. So make sure you bring some loot, or your ass gonna get towed if you park on the side of the street. Letting you know right here, right now, bro, so you don't do nothing dumb. What it do? Y'all, look at this view. Gordon knew exactly what he was doing. Gordon was like, if I'm gonna give him fish and chips, I'm gonna let him eat fish and chips on the water. You feel me? He put the junk right on the water, bro. You know what I'm saying? And that's the reason why he's one of the best chefs in the world. You know what I'm saying? Look, he knew exactly what to do. They even got a statue of Gordon Ramsay out this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Peeling a, peeling a lobster. Damn, Gordon's a goat. Bruh, like this shit is definitely good for like a date night. Like look at this, bro. You know what I'm saying? You bring your broad out here, bro, you getting in them drawers. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. You getting you some pussy, bro. It's like, if you bring a broad out here, bro, it's happening. It's going down. All right, y'all, so you see where I'm at now. I'm at the Gordon Ramsay Fish and the Chips, you know what I'm okay. saying? You see all them Britain flags and all that, bro. We here, bro. We at Gordon Ramsay's place of business. Let's see what's good with it. And on this side, we got the Hell's Kitchen. We've got to come back for that one. We gonna try all Gordon's restaurants, y'all. All right, y'all, so I paid $51 for two meals. Also got a sticky toffee milkshake. You see how it's looking. It's on the guy. Ain't going to lie to y'all. That toffee looking extra sticky. Look at that shit. Sheesh. So I ain't going to lie to y'all, bro. This is fast food. You feel me? We ordered the junk, the junk ready. It's like McDonald's. You know what I'm saying? Shit already sitting in the back. We in there. Let's see what's up with the Gordon Ramsay fish and chips. All right, y'all, so we're going to start out with the sticky toffee uh, milkshake. You know what I'm saying? You see that shit is extra sticky all around the edges, you know what I'm saying? They put that drizzle up on there. Be 100% honest with y'all. You taste no toffee, all you taste is vanilla ice cream. You feel me? So Gordon Ramsay, I'm kind of disappointed off the rip because you're saying that it's a sticky toffee. You got a little bit of sticky toffee around the edges, but it's not in the shape. You know what I'm saying? All I taste is vanilla ice cream. This is an easy 3 out of 10, y'all. It's not what they say it is. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a vanilla shape. Now we got the food. And I ain't going to lie, bro. Food smell crazy, bro. It smell incredible. Not going to lie to y'all. Here we go, y'all. So I ain't going to lie to y'all, the presentation's looking crazy. He got it in this nice little box. I had to pay an extra 75 cents for another sauce. We got the fish right here, shrimp right here, breaded to perfection. We got some Parmesan fries down there. Let's see what's up with it. So I'm going to be 100% honest with you. Gordon kind of stingy, bro. He only gave me three shrimps and two fish sticks. That's all he gave me. He gave me a little lemon so I can go ahead and squeeze it up on there, bro. I'm going to squeeze it up on there. But... $16, bro, and I only got three shrimps and two fish sticks, bro. It better be crazy. Better be. We're going to start out with the fries. So the fries kind of remind me of boardwalk fries. They got a little bit of Parmesan cheese on it and some parsley. That's about it. Let's see what's up with it. We're going to dip it in some of this sauce. 
So I ain't gonna lie to y'all, the fries kind of hit in the tartar sauce, but I'm hearing that this curry mango go crazy. Let's see what's up with the curry mango. Curry mango good. That's some good ass curry. So I ain't gonna lie to y'all, the fries do got a lot of flavor, seasoned up real good, and that Parmesan do what it do. Definitely will eat these fries again, y'all. Parmesan fries, they're gonna get like a 8.5 of the chimp. Now let's see what's up with the shrimp. They only gave me three pieces of shrimp, and I'm thinking the reason why they did that because these shrimps are probably exquisite, bro. You know what I'm saying? They normally do that with the portions and stuff like that when it go crazy. Let's see what's up. Dip it in some curry mango. So look. The breading, the breading is extremely mushy. Like, it's not cooked all the way, you see? Breading's kinda mushy. No flavor at all inside of the, the breading. He didn't put no seasoning in this. He made some batter, went ahead, dipped them in it, and fried them, bro. I'm thinking that's why they come with the sauces, bro, because the sauce is supposed to give you that flavor. But if you just eating these plain, no flavor at all. Like point blank period, bro. And like, bro, it's Gordon Ramsay. Come on, Gordon Ramsay. I know you know how to season some fucking food, bro. Throw some seasoning in this shit. I went to your spot at with the steaks in, in Baltimore, bro. And the steaks was hitting, bro. This shrimp right here, bro, is not hitting. Now let's see what's up with the fish. Ooh. So the fish is cod. When you looking at it, it kind of reminds you of a, a filet of fish sandwich. That's what the fish look like. You know what I'm saying? Look like that fish sandwich fish. Let's try with a little bit of tartar. Go ahead, dip it in there. So the batter is extremely salty. The batter kind of reminds me of Long John Silver's. And Long John Silver's got a shitty review. You know what I'm saying? Way too salty. I don't know what Gordon did with this, bro. But it's it's not what it's supposed to be. I'm honestly disappointed because, like, bro, I was looking forward to this, bro. Like, I'm thinking this is gonna be the best fish and chips ever. I, I literally watched another YouTuber review this and he was like, oh man, dude, this is the best chips and chips and fish that I've ever had in my life. And I'm like, bro, you was just doing that because you too busy sucking Gordon Ramsay's meat because he's the best the best chef in the world, bro. So you're not trying to give your honest opinion, bro. Keep it a band. This shit is disgusting. This shit on the same level as fucking Long John Silver's, bro. Like, I'm going to give Gordon his props. That joint in Baltimore was hitting, bro. That joint go crazy. But this right here, bro, it's shit. Besides the fries, the fries go insane. If I ever ever come back here, bro, it's gonna be for the fries, but the rest of this shit is ass, bro. Honestly, y'all, these gotta be the most bland shrimp I've ever had, bro. The most bland, bro. This shit is seasoned in parsley. That's the only seasoning I see on this parsley, bro. It's crazy, bro. Like. The best chef in the world, like, I get it. Gordon Ramsay's not working in that restaurant. You know what I'm saying? But he stamped it in. You know what I'm saying? Like, he signed his name off on this restaurant, bro. Like, I gotta hold him accountable. Salty ass fish sticks, bro. I was better off going to go get some of them Gordon's jumps from the fucking TV dinner aisle. I shoulda did that. They taste better than this. I'm going to eat it because I spend my hard on cash. But damn, Gordon. This shit. I ain't even about to swallow that shit. That shit is way too salty. Damn, Gordon, you falling off, Slim. Bro, if you want to be a Gordon Ramsay meat rider and think I'm lying, go ahead and try it out. Gordon Ramsay, I got a better name for you, bro. 
Name that shit Long John Ramsey's, bro, because it tastes like Long John Silver's and it's disgusting, bro. Put some seasoning in your shit. Put a little bit of little, little, little. Put a little bit of flavor in your shit. I'm stuttering. I'm so mad. Damn. I drove here for this. I'm spitting now. Damn. I can't even get the words out right now, bro. That's what happens when you got a lisp and you get pissed, bro. You know what I'm saying? You can't even get the words out, dog. Shit just blew me.